Rakib, don't forget. And here we go. Round and one. Back in back action. Guys. Two different styles. He started with landing the first jab. The whole Sobri place went silent for a second. Sobri <laughs> looks very composed. Sobri striking, slept on. Oh, lovely Ooh. right hand from Sobri. That was a stiff Nothing's jab connecting from until now. Azam. They're still managing their distance. Yeah, Sobri both with uh, starting with some jabs. Nice leg kick. Nice Ooh, nice movement. slip. Like that movement, like that movement. Sobri with the in and out oh, movement. Oh, right hand. Try to place that check hook. Ooh. Whoa. And guys, Azam's got the pressure on Sobri. He's got him backing up. Sobri, Sobri attempts a clinch, but he doesn't get it. And uh, Azam with his jabs. I think Azam is very stiff. He needs to be more flexible. He's fast, but very stiff in the but way Ahmed, he shoots. This oh, is oh, one, two. That one, two connected. And Sobri is aware, and he's trying Another to one, move two. away. Another one, two from Sobri. Sobri is using his hands. They are pretty fast. Lovely stiff, ha stiff jab yeah. from the rear corner. I love, I love the pressure from Azam. He's got Sobri backing up. I love Sobri that he's throwing combination, not just one shot. Yes. You know? One, two, Ooh, knee, nice, didn't nice connect. Knee from Azem. Try lovely attempt though. Guys, I think Sobri's game plan is to get that fight to the ground. Ooh. He keeps on attempting to go for the clinch. An elbow, elbow attempt. An elbow. Guys, it's impressive because like Sobri is from gym full of grappler killers. And he's just trying to stand and bang. But he, he, used to he used to train under coach Aizat Haider. This oh, is that's why. Lovely one, two, two. And lovely slips. Lovely head movement yeah. from Omar Sobi on this plate tonight. Oh, mm -hmm. he just okay. need to find his range, but and guys, I think he's gonna uh, do Zen's better. Jab are funding, are funding their home. I think it's because oh, he's very unpredictable. Nice Red right corner hand. with lovely right hand. Azam is very unpredictable with his jabs. Yes, even though Azam. they're stiff. Oh, what a right Ooh. hand! What a right hand! Bring Sobi on the floor! I don't think that was a knockdown, though. He, he had him on. No, he had his leg yes, and he... just struck him. He yes. is down. But it, it, you can call it, you can count it, count it knock down because it's the back of the floor. If I was Azam, I would do exactly what he did. You don't want to engage in the ground with Omar Sabri. Absolutely. And uh, Omar Sabri is now. Back but you to know the, the thing is, uh, Omar Sabri. Oh, lovely combination nice from combo Omar Sabri. By Omar Sabri. As Ahmed said, Sabri keeps on throwing these boxing combos. Ooh. That's what makes him connect and get closer to his range. Oh, Ooh. what a, a, a one-two. That was whole cross, right? This is a yeah, strike. Was. Oh, three, two, and lovely, lovely work from both fighters. I think he wants to attempt uh, spinning back fist. Sabri is looking for it. Yes, yeah, Sabri's looking for Oh, he's fitting with the back. elbow. I love that. Pretty even till now. Yes, yes. Back I and forth. I think Sabri is trying to work. Stiff jab Azam by both mixing of it up with the body shot. Lovely one. Oh, that, that barely kick. He grazed. missed that kick. He barely was connecting. And I think that was a hard one. Good attempt from the blue corner so far. Abhamid Sayyad keep Ab advising him. One of the best coaches in Egypt till now. And oh, oh, that was nice by Omar, Omar Sabri. Boxing. Omar Sabri's got some nice boxing. He's found his range. And he looks like he's slowly taking control of the fight. I believe so. I believe if he stays composed, he could probably pick uh, Azam apart. However, I Azam is very unpredictable and very explosive, actually. I think actually. the whole team need to... Guys, Azam, I, I don't like how Azam keeps on leaning over, man. Omar Sobri's... Oh, Ooh, wow, that I left hook that connected. That lovely. One, two by Sobri, connect. Sobri okay, goes okay. for the inside chin leg kick. Chin, chin to chin. Sobri is trying to find his groove here, ladies and gentlemen. And he's finding it. He's finding it rhythm, his rhythm. Sobri, message. oh, I told you he's Ooh. looking for the back fist, but it didn't land. That leg kick hurt. But Sabri shakes it off. You know, the, the, nice thing that jab. I love, the thing I love about the red corner, they are still controlling. Ooh. They are in control, yeah. but they are losing the fight, but they're still in control. You know what I mean? Yeah, but but the, I, I don't like the pop. It. He's controlling the cage itself. Ooh. Oh, Ooh, another head that kick, left kick is missed. money. That left kick is money for Omar Sabri. Flying attempt to the body. Yeah, that high kick is money connect? because Alam ki, uh, Azam keeps on leaning over, guys. Oh, oh from both fighters. I was about to say, you know, uh, Omar Sabri need to stop Omar slipping Sabri to the right. With the, with the, it was a bit of a slow level change. That's why Azam saw it. Look at the strains now. But I like the timing of it. Like if you understand what I'm saying is, like Omar Sabri is always fainting to the right. 
So if he recognized that the right corner is gonna Ooh. high kick right like this, he's gonna be down. Did see Lin Lin Edwards knock out? And yeah. the end of the round. That's what one. I mean. Yeah, yeah, because because Omar Sabri's head. Omar Sabri's head moving keeps on like leaning this. to the right. So if he's leaning to the right, can Finn Jack hook up with? Yes, but, but at the same works. time, uh, at the same time, Ahmed Azam keeps on leaning to the right side, which which exposes his face to Sabri's left high kicks, Absolutely. and he's and Sabri's already he's thrown two high kicks, yeah. and he's missed by an inch, man. This game, game of inches, game of Sir. intelligence, game of confidence, and game of humbleness, game said of he's... forgiveness, game of violence. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Yes, sir. What a nice way to interpret it. Uh, Azam said he's gonna knock uh, Sabri out in the first round. And here we see the first round is done. And maybe the second round is Azam's uh, round. But we don't know. Sabri is still in the game. Sabri is looking sharp. Both of them getting... I believe the momentum is on Sabri's side, Mazin. He, he has found his rhythm. Yeah, at first he was a uh, little hesitant. and But now I think he's finding his rhythm, yeah, and uh, I think he's trusting himself more as the fight goes on. Yeah, and it's a medium pace first round, so I don't think uh, any of the fighters has gassed out, but Azam has been exploding, guys. Azam has been exploding inside of the range, to get inside of the range. To be fair, both of them are doing a great job. They just need to adjust to that little small adjustment if they can see what mistakes the other are doing and take advantage of it. That's how I see the fight in now. And a big shout to the ring gears who keep shining every round. <laughs> please, if any of the ring girls is watching this, please text Ahmed after this event. Please. Thank you. I'm 0 and 12 guys, and I'm going to answer a goal. Azem's got the height advantage, but this is a prime example of, of how to use your reach. I think Omar Sabri is utilizing his reach better than Azem. That's why Omar Sabri is connecting while Azem is not. Here we go, back in action round two. Round two starts. Oh, lovely nice jab. jabs by Omar Sabri. Both are ex ex exchanging jabs, and but Omar Sabri taking the edge. Oh, oh that right hand, hand connected, man! Azam is in trouble. Azam is in trouble, guys. And he's like, where are you going? You're laughing. Getting his tongue out. And he's looking for the finish. A lovely oh, right hand. Oh, Sabri is looking confident for the Sabri finish. Sabri is him. Be cold, man. He is down. What's going on, lad? Guys, Sabri is punishing Azam with these punches, man. He's punishing him. Azam still trying to find the range. Azam is leaning to the left, yes. right, like you said. Oh, lovely right hand for Azam still. And guys, Azam is still pressuring Sabri, although he's a bit Ooh. wobbled. I love the way that. I, oh, Sabri fins. I don't, I don't think that was a good idea, guys. Yeah, Sabri was finding his move the striking. He was doing neither damage. Do yeah, he was doing damage. Could have ended it. That makes me sometimes wonder, why do they do that? You know why? I think it's all mental. Do you understand what I mean, Mazin? Like, if so, if I'm, I'm if I'm doing great job on the feet, but mentally when I look at you, I feel I'm kind of I'm kind of shocked that I didn't get the finish. So I so I shoot for down. the takedown. So yeah, I broke I down. Ooh, yeah, yeah, I mean, so and guys, Sabri's that, Sabri's pulling that? guard. This is weird. <laughs> Sabri, what Sabri. is that? That's a Ooh. monkey thing. That's Ooh. a monkey thing. And he's slapping. And Azem is posing. Two all night. He's slapping in the oh. chair out of him. Oh. So Azem is posing. Down. And guys. It takes so much confidence to, 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 to attempt such a such a movement while yeah. he was winning the fight. And right now, look, he's, he's in big trouble, I reckon. I think, lovely I think, elbow. I think Sabri's jitsu camp, the, the, the heavy base jitsu camp has been getting to him. The, the guy pulled guard while he was having so much success in the striking department. Elbow. I don't think it's a good idea, but we'll see the submission threats from Omar Sabri right now. You know, that's exactly what I was trying to clarify with Mazin. I'm trying to tell him, I'm asking him. I just wonder when that things happen. And look, he's in big trouble right now. What, what, like, I don't know how he's going to get out. He made himself literally lose Ooh. whole round. Head and arm choke from bottom position in guard, but I don't think he can get it. It's a very hard submission to execute from bottom position. What do you think, Mez? Well, uh, I think uh, we get to see now the, the game, the ground game of Azam. And I'm very intrigued. And Sabri. And Sabri, but oh, lovely elbow. We know that Sabri is uh, jiu-jitsu based. However, uh, Azam, we don't know about his ground games so, that much. And we get to see it now. You know, one, one funny thing about Azam that he mentioned that he used to compete in school arranged fight. <laughs> he used <laughs> to make money while fighting with his colleagues or his teammates or students or whatsoever. He loves fight. He's That's why he loves fire. to crap. Yeah. That's why he's so lucky now. 
I, I think Omar Sabri was winning this fight and he gave it away to Azam. He gave that second round away to Azam because this is all top control in favor of Azam, even if he's not landing that many ground and pound shots. This Sabri. is all in favor of Azam. Sabri is trying with some mission attempts. I know what I, I, I know that he's got so much confidence in his coach, Sharaf al Din, but like, he shouldn't. Bottom position in MMA is different than bottom position in Jiu Jitsu bouts. Yeah. Like, he shouldn't pull guard in MMA. He's so flexible. Look. Look at his knees wearing that off. Oh, he's super flexible. Like 99% of the time, you shouldn't pull guard in MMA because because of the ground and pound threat. It's not jiu -jitsu, it's not yeah. a jiu-jitsu bout. Yeah, everyone has a plan until he gets punched, punched in the face. <laughs> yeah, but, uh, but Azem, Azem was the one getting punched, man. I don't know why uh, uh, Sabri pulled guard, but we'll see what he does with this position. He keeps on slapping him. There's movement, but guys, Stockholm, welcome to 09. <laughs> we are in Egypt, Kodia. Subri, Subri, uh, I think Subri's in control of this position 100%. Okay, Subri's but you know attempting what, Subri, a choke here. It, Subri shows so much confidence. The guy was winning the fight, he made one, one yeah, he, mistake, and he still didn't get Oh, Subri's any looking for the Omo Plata. You have to be delusional to pull guard. And look, he's trying, he's attempting as, as he in test, so Ooh. I'm gonna try to be in the floor and now knock him out if it didn't work it's the third round, you know? That's how I see it. I, guys, Azam keeps on trying, but he doesn't seem to be able to pass Sabri's guard. Sabri's guard game is very good. But I mean, what, Ooh, you he's looking for the triangle. Ooh. Triangle choke. However, Azam, Azam looks knows away what Sabri's trying to do. Slow celebrity, slow celebrity right now. I think now. this is what Azam meant when he said he had a, a, a heavy jiu jitsu camp. And right now, I agree no, with him. He's still looking for that triangle. He's very committed to it. 10 seconds 10 to the end of the uh, to the first round. Second round. Second. It's going to be intriguing how the judges would score this uh, round. Because uh, Sabri was active actually off of his back, even though he pulled guard, even though he was in the bottom position, he was very active looking for submissions. Azam was also looking for the ground and pound. So it's, I think, in my opinion, it was very even. The first Five. round, uh, yeah, Sabri got some uh, uh, Heavy success. Shots. Yeah, yeah but shots. the second round is very baked in. Yeah? yeah, but guys, this is MMA. <laughs> all of that, all of that is control time in favor of Azam. I think, it, I think it's, I think the second round is very. Good. But the first round, uh, Azam was being clipped. And in the second round, in the first half of the second round, Azam was being clipped and he got wobbled. But I don't know why Sabri pulled guard. Maybe it's a gas tank. Uh, maybe it's it's a problem with gas maybe tank. It's, I think getting the tired. thing, like I told you. Yeah, or yeah. maybe he's just crazy to the level, like, you want to come down, let's test ourselves down. And I'll knock you out the third round. If he has that kind of mentality, I, don't think so. I give so much credit to that dude. I think it's a gas tank issue. I, I think mean. it's a big no. mental side, like I told yeah, you. Yeah, like he's like uh, I'm, frustrated I'm from. I'm doing uh, yeah. so much damage, but I can't finish it. Okay, I'll try down. You know what I mean? Yeah, I know but what if you mean. He's smart. No, I would adjust. Mm. If he would have took his time, he would have finished him, man. He, Sabri was close right. to the finish. I, I couldn't. It's agree not like more. Sabri tried to finish him many times and he couldn't. Like, he was close to the finish. Guys, all of our all of our questions will be answered right now. The third round is starting soon, and the ring girl. Hey, Matt, I'll let never you take stop. over from They <laughs> never stop. Big shout for them. Third round, here we go. Third bird, we're still on the floor. Yes, sir. But guys, I saw Amor Sabi take a deep breath between the first and the second round, and now he's doing it again. He's breathing so heavy. Here we go, back in action. Third I don't like round. how Sabi's breathing, man. Maybe he's just taking Be a breath. I think because <laughs> he got hit in his nose. His nose is all Ooh. swollen up. And that Bad job, man. And Azam, his his eyes are ready. I don't think it's swollen up, uh, Ahmed. I think no, his, no, his I nose is kind of ugly, man. Sayyad, I saw how he's doing a lot of Vaseline on his nose. I think there's a problem with it. Nice jabs. I love the jabs from Amos Sabri. I love the combinations as well. Don't forget, he never threw one Guys, punch. He threw, then he goes. Yeah, I think. Ooh, Ooh, nice elbow while Azam was trying was to explode 11, with his jab. Oh, that right hand landed. Nice oh, right hand. And another one. And the bank. Omar Sabri is Going lethal, to guys. Oh, oh, Ooh, nice Azam right is flat-footed. Azam is flat-footed right now. He can't get no more. Azam has no answers in the striking department, guys. Azam has no answers. Oh, oh and another oh, one. Kick. Is he rocked? Oh, my goodness. If he had that high kick, high kick would be a money. But Mazin, Ahmed, I think Azam is praying that uh, Sabri repeats his mistakes and pull guard. Azam what is he breathing think? heavy, like you said. Yeah. He's flat-footed. Look at his, his angles now. 
Ooh, but, it, but a very nice low kick. And the Omar Sobri mixing Ooh. it up, mixing the body shots perfectly with the headshots. He's not headhunting, although his, his punches are wobbling at them. Lovely low kick still, trying to find a way to get that victory, which is pretty hard, we can see. But yet we see who's gonna get his hand raised. Nice low kicks by Azem. He's establishing some respect in the striking department. You know, Azem is slowing down. I think he can finish the fight, but he's slowing down. And I'll be surprised if he took him down. I'll be very surprised. I don't think he's gonna do that, man. He's having so much. Ooh, oh, he, right there hand we go, connects. There we go. He, he Guys, yeah, Subri's putting a clinic for us. Subri's putting on a striking clinic, man. Oh, oh, nice. And here's an attempt for a takedown from the rear. And guys, corner. he's got the takedown. His hands were clenched. Oh, and that guillotine, is it tight? If he, you know what? He will never get it. If he can do it one hand, it's done. It's very smart. It's very smart uh, thinking from Max. I think he can get it. He can get it because he has good jiu jitsu. Two hands, you can get it. Now he's trying but, with one but, hand. Look at what I'm saying. Azem is he's trying hand. with one hand and it's tight. It's and it's going to be the end of the round. But Ahmed, no, no, no. It's very hard to execute the guillotine from half guard position. Sabri out. needs to retain his guard. Out. Right. Nice. Can we please out. appreciate as. Uh, as, as as Azam said, his fight IQ is next level. What do you think about the timing on the takedown, Mazen? Well, actually, this is what he needed, and this is what he did. Uh, the game plan is to take him down. I, I don't think that was the game plan before, but now after making some adjustments, he knew that he would be superior, but Sabri with a nice... Sabri with a nice butterfly sweep. Ooh! And Azam takes a triangle oh choke, goodness, and it's... And it's locked in. If he just get his hand down, it's done. And guys, Azam has one win in his resume by armbar. So Azam is squeezing so hard. Azam has broken an arm before oh. in, by submission. So he, he, he's got the submission he there. Get Don't get it wrong, ladies and gentlemen. He needs to pull his head down. He needs to if he pull his head down, I think it, it would be more tight and he would tap. No, no, no. He no, needs to go to his right. No, no, no. I think he needs I think he needs to get... His right, right hand, right hand on the other side. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Look at that elbows, he's slicing him up. He's slicing him up. Ooh. Those elbows are nasty, are nasty, nasty yeah. to the head. They make you bleed all day long and you will never forget that dude. Very nice work here from Azam. Azam, Azam needs to get Sobri's right hand but to the other side. He's squeezing so hard. He's squeezing do you see, so do you see Sobri's right hand? Sobri's right hand needs to go to the other side so that he can choke himself. Leg and pull his uh, head. Trust me, it's down in it's, three seconds. No, no, it's, he's not gonna get shocked out like that. Azam needs control over Sabri's right hand. Oh, no, show you. Okay, man. <laughs> Guys, stay tuned. Me and the mother are gonna have a jiu jitsu about to see what's <laughs> It's just a learning process, that, learning process. Don't, 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 that, don't get me wrong. I don't fight with my colleagues, never ever. <laughs> Nice, nice triangle by Azem. I, I, I bet his leg now is all swore out. Yeah, He's squeezing so hard for a long time, minutes. He's out. He's out. He needs to fight. Oh, that's that's, nice. this that's is what, what he saying. needed to that's do. This is what he needed to do nice. to finish this the submission. Deep, guys. Do you think he's going to attempt me? Sabri was some desperate ground. You know, he can take arm, arm triangle. He can take his arm. What's, what's, what are you trying to do, Azam? Yes, and Azam has got to finish by armbar. He actually snapped that. You know, it's the last Ooh. round. He, someone needs to get the finish. Now it's 10, ten seconds. seconds Holy moly. 10 seconds left. Guys, and if he got it. that finish right now, if he got it, it would be the most impressive thing of the Ooh. night. Oh, oh my goodness. I think what a heart. What a heart from our sub. I think this was a statement by Azam at the end. Yeah, they Honestly, were. but it's still a very close fight to me. But both know. have very good skills, I think. From the <laughs> ground, wrestling, striking, I can give the edge a bit for Sabri, but he didn't utilize it the right way. He didn't have the courage enough to stand and keep banging. So we give him respect for his heart, didn't tap at the end of the round. But we cannot say who who is the winner. We shall see right now. But great performance from both fighters. I really love that fight. Yeah. I love Sabri's boxing. Yeah, I think uh, if he didn't pull that guard, maybe Azam wouldn't have known that he would be superior on the ground. Yeah, maybe that could have changed everything. Yeah, let's agree that if Sabri didn't pull guard in that second round, he would have took that round in the bank. And he actually could have finished it. Because yeah, uh, Azam have... was actually rough. Yeah, yeah, Azam was getting clipped, man. That was... 
beautiful display from both fighters. I like the fight, I like how everyone tried to attempt different unique position and now with Rocky. Whenever we have something to say, Rakib keeps on interrupting us. Now he's not interrupting us. I don't know what's up with Rakib. After three entertaining rounds, the judges rendered their decisions. Judges scored 30-27, 29-28, 29-28. And by unanimous decision, the winner is Ahmed Azar! Muhammad Azam. Guys, uh, I'm not gonna lie, I, I, I saw that because of that guard pull control time for Omar Sub, uh, for Azam in that second round. He took the second round home and that beautiful takedown by Azam in the third round. What do you think about the timing of the takedown, Mazen? Well, that timing, yeah, it was perfect. I think uh, this is what he needed to do to take the W and the judges saw that too. And here we see the triangle attempt at the third round. Uh, it was very... Uh... It was very unexpected.